Hello, I'm Gordon Richard with Cole Morgan, and this is Two Minutes of Motion. AKD graphical user interface, known as Workbench, provides a lot of power to the user and is very intuitive to use. This segment is a quick overview of the software. When we open Workbench, we find the connection screen. Since we are connecting and communicating over Ethernet, it is possible to see and connect to more than one drive. If you are looking for one drive, you can click on it, then click blink. The front of the drive will begin to flash 8.8. Once inside the software, we find navigation very easy. The tree down the left-hand side of the toolbar and across the top provides us with a lot of good visual indicators. Clicking on settings, we expand the tree out. Clicking on the access name, we find and check the serial number hardware version, firmware version, and accumulative hours. If the firmware needs to be updated, we can change it here. Down the tree are the different locations for setting things like power, motor, feedback, and also the tree will change depending on the settings. Notice that switching from torque to velocity adds the velocity loop screen, and changing from position adds the position loop screen as well. The unit screen helps us to define the user units when setting up the system. And we can put those units in those that make sense for the application. Clicking into the motion task screen, we can see that it reflects the units set in the earlier screen. Everything is interconnected, so if the units change, so will the motion task. If this one video segment was address every screen in Workbench, it would turn into a full-length movie, and then we'd have to hire Brad Pitt to play me. Since Brad is otherwise occupied, I would simply say, I'm Gordon Ritchie for Two Minutes of Motion. Check out our other segments.